Swati Crop from Thailand. This is HS0ZMJ, also known as N3QEH in America. Today I'm going to talk to you about my external antenna tuner. It's an LDG Z11 Pro 2. And we're going to discuss something I discovered about it a couple of weeks ago. What you're looking at right now is a tri-band rotatable dipole, although as you can see I don't have a rotator currently installed on it. It's on the second floor attached to the roof of my house in Thailand. It is a 10, 15, and 20 meter tri-band antenna. What we're going to discuss is how the internal antenna tuner built into my radio can tune 10, 15, and 20 quite easily. And surprisingly, the LDG tuner can actually tune this antenna on 40 meters. So let's take a quick look at this. Here we have a quick look at how the SWR reads on 10 meters. You'll see I first pick the middle of the band and give you a quick reading and then we'll switch over to a scan of the entire band. And you'll see that the antenna actually performs quite well right on its own. Here we have the same thing for 15 meters. A quick display of the SWR in the middle of the band followed by the sweep of the entire band so you can get an overall feel for the SWR of this antenna on 15 meters. Again you'll notice the antenna performs quite well on 15 meters without any tuning at all. And now we come to 20 meters. This is the last band that this antenna is designed for. As you can see it still performs quite well. It's not perfect but the internal antenna tuner can take care of this no problem at all. So now we're going to switch over to 40 meters and I'll show you what kind of readings I get from this rig expert analyzer on 40. First thing to note is that 40 meters in Thailand is only 7.0 megahertz to 7.2 megahertz. Therefore that's all I'm going to analyze here. You'll notice that it is reading at infinite in the middle of the band and across the entire band. This antenna analyzer typically displays SWR up to about 13 to 1. After that it just reads as infinite. So from this display all I can really tell you is that we have something above 13 to 1 SWR. Here I set the radio to FM so that we had a carrier wave to tune with the external tuner. As you can see this tuner quickly was able to match the radio and the antenna on 7.1 MHz. I was blown away by this considering it's clearly 13 to 1 or higher SWR, but it seems to work. Now I will note that this is the only band this seems to work for at this time, so I don't know what the SWR readings are for the rest of the spectrum, but this tuner will tune 40 meters on a tri-band 10, 15, 20 meter antenna. I was quite surprised by this. Seven threes and have a wonderful time on the air.